all the staff must wear Hisense standard work clothes and service certificate issued by Hisense. First, remove the fan guard, screw off the fixed nut, and remove the gasket and fan, and clean the dust on the surface with a high-pressure water gun. In case of stubborn dust, use the cleaner brush to pretreatment. After cleaning, dry the fan and check whether there are cracks on the fan blade and the root of the fan blade. Use the brush to clean the motor shaft and the surface of the machine. Check whether there is rust and corrosion inside the shaft sleeve and apply a small amount of anti-rust oil. Check whether there is deformation or damage on the motor bracket. After confirmation, replace the fan, fix it with gasket and nut, and mark it with marking pen. Rotate the fan to ensure that there is no friction between the fan blade and the upper cover. Replace the fan guard. Firstly, remove the protective net of heat exchanger. Wash the floating dust on the surface of the heat exchanger with clean water from top to bottom. Then, spray the heat exchanger cleaner to stand still for 10 minutes. After the dirt reacts with the cleaner, clean the stubborn dust with a soft brush, and then wash them with a high-pressure water gun from top to bottom. Finally, blow out the rest water with a blower. Repair damage the fins with professional tool. Turn off the power supply of all the unit. Open the cover of electrical box. Use anti-static brush to sweep the dust sticking on the surface of circuit board and other electrical components. And then use a blower to clean the surface of electrical components. Check that the communication cable, power cable, and other plug-in terminals are on the base plate are not loose, and check the power cable free of damage on the surface. Check whether the air conditioner is in good condition. Turn on the power and check whether the voltage between the fire and the neutral is within the acceptable range. Take a small amount of compressor oil with pressure gauge, and check whether the oil color meets the requirements. Clean the base plate of all the unit with high-pressure water gun and dry the water with a blower. Check whether there is rust on the bottom plate due to damage, which can be made up with white paint in time. Test the whole system. Connect the data collector to accumulate data confirm whether the system is in good condition. If there is leakage in the system, some refrigerant can be charged until the operation data meets standard. After confirming that all screws have been completely installed, clean the floating dust on the machine surface 
with high pressure water gun. Spray cleaner, and then flush and dry the machine surface. Check whether the insulation and protective layer of external piping are in good condition, and repair the damaged part in time. After all the work is completed, the commissioning data and verification results shall be submitted to the customer.